Hi Cancer, this is Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot and I am here to do your weekly general reading for January 8th through January 14th. This is for the sign of Cancer. Now this is a general reading, it may not resonate, just take what does and leave the rest. I will be doing a love reading next, so stay tuned for that, it will be a separate video. I have pre-shuffled this deck, so I'm only going to shuffle it for a moment. And this is just a general reading. Focus this in. All right, so it appears like you guys are, you know, starting to feel better. You know, if things are starting to feel better, you're probably no longer worrying as much. Maybe you're starting to concentrate on the future rather than living in the past. Perhaps something has happened recently. You know, some truth came out and, you know, it might have been a shock, may have been kind of uh, like a little awakening. Something woke you up, caused some changes in your life. Maybe some, some path is no longer an option and you've come to the realization that you have uh, bigger dreams ahead of you. Maybe you're headed in a new direction. That's what it feels like to me that you're, you know, I see wish fulfillment here after a period of... Um, maybe having some regrets, maybe feeling at a loss. You may have went through a loss recently and went through a period of depression per se, you know, and now you're, you've changed your, your thinking and you're thinking about the future instead of the past. That's what I see. I mean, it feels like uh, you're getting over some heartache, okay? But you're still healing. You are. You're still healing but you're you're taking the steps needed to heal all right it feels like um you know you could be scheduling some travel or, or thinking about a vacation uh there could be some legal matters this week that you're that are closing up that you're dealing with um, you could be releasing something really heavy so you're just taking the time to do that you're bringing some balance back to your life you may be feeling a little uneasy financially feeling you know like oh god you know this is ridiculous I, this is going to cost me some money but the fact of the matter is is it's 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 meant to be okay but everything happens for a reason it is bringing you something better when the tower comes out in a reading you know perhaps something has happened that is bringing you something much much better it's usually a blessing in disguise you know maybe you uh, what's the word prevented something from from happening that was really really that could have been worse okay you prevented a worse outcome by by taking some action by being honest perhaps because this is the this is the sword of truth the ace of swords it's it's when you're offered the raw truth you're offered the raw truth or you're offered some kind of power Okay, so that's good. It's, it, it feels like you guys are using your own truth to get through something um, the right way. It looks like there's justification this week. There's, um, there's some kind of honesty. There's some kind of honesty that's paying off. Okay, it is paying off in your favor, even though you're feeling you may be having regrets or, or having some feelings of grief over it. You know what I'm saying? There's there's mixed feelings here. There's mixed feelings. You have you there's definitely mixed feelings. That's exactly what it is. You know, you're having mixed feelings over something. You're headed in the right direction, but you're still having mixed feelings about it. What is this Nine of Cups? 
this is the nine of cups is wish fulfillment in some way it's like there's a new door that's opening and i think you're taking action the reason this door is opening because you're bringing some balance back to your life it's like i need to bring balance back to my life and perhaps this week is when you start to do that it's when the healing process has already started this is a week of healing in some way it's like you're going through some kind of renewal that leads to the ultimate wish fulfillment you know and you might have have to close a door to get there so you may many of you could be becoming single you may have become single recently you know had there could have been some kind of breakup and you're still having mixed feelings was it the right thing to do okay this is a general reading so I mean we're not trying to make it a love reading but it feels like there's the, that your emotions are on your heart you know you're this is a week of feeling you know and you're just working on getting your feelings intact, you know, staying uh, in control of your emotions. But I feel like you're not completely happy, even though you're moving in the right direction. There's a not you're not completely happy because there's there's some kind of hurt that is still on the surface. But you're working on healing. So this is a week of healing, perhaps. You guys, many of you, there's been some kind of you've there's been like a split of some sort. You've some maybe you were let go of and it was against your will, you know what I mean? Maybe somebody let you go. Could be a work, could be, you know, that's what it appears to me. It feels like somebody let you go and you're still healing from it. Okay? Now, this is a pure week of bringing balance back to your life, okay? You may be trying to escape the truth. You may be trying to escape the pain with addictions or whatever the case may be. But the fact of the matter is, is this is a week of healing and bringing balance back to your life. That's what I see. Let's see what else we can get for advice here. It's just going to be short and sweet. Your love reading is coming up next. I feel like something has happened that has caused a big change in your life. And there's nothing you can do about it other than work through it. Might be a little bit of unhappiness. But, you know, it was the truth. It needed to happen because it's a blessing and it brings you something much better. It's going to lead to your wish fulfillment. I feel like something ended. A path that you were on is it's over. It's over. And now all you can do is work through it. Law of Attraction. Each thought is an investment that pays immediate dividends, so invest wisely. You have the power to choose your thoughts and align them with love, peace, and harmony. At your request, we gladly attune your energies to higher frequencies. So basically, this tells me that you're working through something. And your positive thoughts are taking you far. I understand perhaps you're going through some hurt. You're going through a loss. But that, like at the beginning of the reading, that's what I see. There's been a loss. But I feel like you guys are, are working through it with your positive thoughts. That's exactly what's going on. You realize that this is a blessing in disguise even though it hurts. And it's going to take time to figure out the next step to, to, for this to heal. Okay, but many of you are we're dealing with a karmic situation anyway. Okay, it feels like a choice has been made, and it perhaps it wasn't your choice, but there was a reason for it. Okay, it's time for you to real and think about your future. Don't look back. Your future looks bright. This is what I have, Cancer. Stay tuned for your love reading. <laughs>